There's infiltrate. So yeah, we've got a uh, little manor house to explore this morning for you. Hopefully. <laughs> That's if we can find the door open. things. Guys, we're in. <clears throat> yeah, we've got some sensors on poles here. We've got to try and uh, This is a uh, real expensive manor house. I'm gonna have to try and be as quick as I can because we set the alarms off. But... I wanna show you as much as we can.
here. This is a bit of a uh, strange one. It's a bit different from the uh, underground stuff we do. Yeah. In the bookcase, is it? What a full, full store. One second, wait there. We just never hear, guys. Hmm, strange one. So there is a uh, door on the back of that bookcase, which would have been a false wall, right? False wall going into that room. small but still a bar and I tell you guys there uh, there's some crazy woodwork gone into this place this would have been the reception when it took over as a hotel yeah that beeping noise you can hear guys that is um Alarm we set off. Some pictures of what it will look like. This would have been the uh, front door. Glass work, guys. Right. Way out of here, thank you. So ladies and gents, that was just a quick little taster. Um, 
yeah, check out part two for the whole tour. Like, this is just a quick run around of uh, Marcia, just to give you a rough idea of what the what's going to be in the main video, which is all the upstairs and the bow tower. Get out of here now, without being seen, hopefully. But yeah. Like, subscribe, and all that stuff, and uh, see you in the next. This is what the uh, people that were uh, staying here would have been uh, using. Some nasty bit of mould down there. Crazy old picture of London. Some 
boot was the one out. Yeah, guys, this was um, originally owned by the Atomic Weapons Establishment for Britain. And, um, yeah, this was the hotel, basically. People that were traveling from all around the world to come to England to uh, help us build the atomic bomb would have stayed here. And then, um, yeah, it got turned into a hotel and then abandoned. Another alarm I just set off. Here we go up, guys, see what's upstairs. Poor old plant. We've got another sensor up here, guys. I think it's a bit past not setting them off. It's, it's a bit late for that. Turn them around there just so the other guys don't keep setting them off when they come up. Another bedroom. Lovely morning, guys. Sunrise. It is uh, like 20 to 7 in the morning. I mean, we've been out since um, about 8 o'clock last night. Hunting down bunkers and places to film. We finally settled with this. Well, I got lucky then, guys. Before I uh, found a little underground. The bathroom looks like it's been smashed up. Oh, the ceiling's uh, falling apart. The trouser press. So yeah, we're actually planning on doing an overnight challenge here with uh, me in the secret vault and maybe a few others. We'll have to wait and see. I think it'd be a mad one spending the night here guys, you never know. Yeah guys, this takes you uh, up to the back of the clock, which can be seen from outside. So, yeah, this is quite an old, old part. Deceased animal.
the uh, clock as so. well. The pendulum and the workings. And that would run out through there to the back of the clock face. Like so. Let's keep going up these rickety old stairs. Guys, it's going to get a little bit dark. I do have a light, but it's not worth getting out for a few seconds. We're almost there. Oh. Rather high now, guys. Down there is where the uh, guard hut is, literally not far through the uh, tree line there. So we have a big sort of centre there. Yeah, this is what it looks like from above. In the clock tower which is the uh, highest part of this building, guys. And then, yeah, they boarded up these windows. Maybe someone's tried to uh, climb through, I don't know. All right, let's venture back down. I didn't like the sound of that. The metal stairs have definitely seen better days. Right guys, we're being chased, we're being chased. Come on, come on, come on. Right, we're out of here guys.
I'm gonna pause the video for there. I'll get back to you when we're clear. Uh, we just got chased out of there big. Kev. 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 This way. See, that got crazy, guys. Real quick. We now just got to try and get back to the car. I thought it was my friend playing a prank on me, guys. That's why I paused the video. But yeah, it turned out it wasn't. <laughs> we just really upset some Albanians. That's why I sound a bit. The thing is, he made us. Seen us heading off down the driveway, guys. And, uh, yeah, I'm basically doubling back on myself now. Giving him the old double, double bluff. So we'll go this way and walk up. So there you go, guys. That's the older Marston. And that's the uh, atomic weapons establishment. That's their manor house. And uh, yeah, when you think you're alone, you went. So yeah, that got real fun real fast. But yeah, make sure you tune in for the next one, guys. And uh, I'll put a little ending in this as well, just so you know we are uh, got away clean. Cheers, guys. So yeah, guys, uh, we got away. We're a man down at the secret vault. Got, got caught, I think, because he, uh, he had the dog with him, unfortunately, so he had no chance of escape. But yeah, it's about two, three hours on from that little uh, adventurous runaway we had now. Yeah, the, the little adventures. And uh, yeah, guys, we're basically just waiting for our lift now to come and get us, because uh, we've had to call back up. He knows who he is. Is a reliable source that I can always uh, call on when I'm in, in need. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's becoming more of a habit than uh, than than it was a joke, like. But yeah, guys. Anyway, <clears throat> stay tuned for the next one for more madness. But yeah, subscribe, like, and all that, all that stuff. Sound.